Hello, fellow tots. Oh, hi. <laughs> we are all decked out. This is obviously the MegaCon vlog, because why else would I be Ka pink? Ka-chow. Ka Mathematical. <laughs> Ka-chow. That's the sound it makes, you know, when he holds it up and it's like, cha -chee. But like it's the fact that you said ka-chow, like Ka Lightning Ka McQueen. <laughs> Ka-chow. <laughs> Funny story. So we were watching, I was watching something on TikTok and it was like, oh, I just realized that Owen Wilson plays Lightning McQueen. It was like a comment. Oh, no and worries. somebody else was like, you don't hear the wow in ka-chow? Ka-chow. <laughs> but anyway, obviously right, right. we're Adventure Time characters. I'm Princess Bubblegum. That's pretty apparent. Bunny's costume is somewhere back there. She's Bun Bun. We got Jake and Finn. Jake's not with us yet, but he'll be there soon. <laughs> and then we have Ice King, Marceline, or Marceline, Marshall Lee, and Bimo. So the whole group will be together sometime today. Oh my God, the wig is in my eyeballs. All right, see you at the convention center. We made it. And we got our Bimo. And the doggies the pop -ups put their costumes on. We got Jake and we got a bum Oh my goodness. Now we're filming TikToks because what else am I going to do with this look that I'm in right now? It's a neck break, but it's not really a break. Just a snack start. <laughs> hey, Megan, how are you feeling? Really cool. <laughs> bum how are you feeling? She said take the costume off. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry, Tots. I have not been filming a lot because it's just so crowded and we are just trying to navigate the space, but look at Bon Bon's little settle on my foot. He's so cute. Yeah. She said, Mom, stop talking about me. You already made me wear this ridiculous costume. But I always forget I'm pink and then I turn on the camera. <laughs> this is a new experience for me. I have not painted myself pink before. Um, but we're waiting for the Lana, Lana Perella. Is that how you say her last name? Perella? Faria. She's Regina or the Evil Queen from Once Upon a Time. So we're waiting for her panel right now. I'm so excited! I love Once Upon a Time. I don't think I talk about how much I love Once Upon a Time. Hello, Tots. The Queen of England herself is here. This is incredible. <gasps> She's, she's not even out. They just put her picture up. <laughs> when, when they said boo, when it changed away. <laughs> I'm just going to keep it rolling. I might cut some of this out, future top, but keep it rolling. And so she's here. Woo! I walk up on stage. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I guess we're going to go. Are you guys going to make it fun? Woo! All right, we're going to get this panel on the way in just a few short moments. A couple house rules. We do have some microphones in the audience. House for rules. She is the one. She is the only. Mother Parra! He looks like Henry. First of all, this is spectacular. Your mother's name is Crystal. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Crystal. This is so sweet. It's his birthday. And he wanted to give a gift to Lana. She's dressed exactly like me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I'm crying. <laughs> okay, so we just got out of the Lana Perella. <laughs> I have my Ice King now. Just got out of the Lana Perella panel, um, AKA Regina, AKA the Evil Queen from Once Upon a Time. She was so funny. Like she kept saying these witty things, like she was still in character for Regina, like 10 out of 10. Also like just all the cosplays behind us are so good. Megan's back. What did you think of Lana? Oh, she was awesome. She was awesome. She was really good. She was very genuine. <laughs> I am still so pink. 
I don't know why it surprises me. Like I turn the camera on and I'm like, <laughs> bake. Now I'm just people watching. Look at all those chickens. This is what it's like at MegaCon, my friends. It is very crowded. Very crowded. I got it rolling. Whoa. We are in the Star Wars community section. Yeah, section. Oh my gosh. It's it's like almost better than Galaxy's Edge. Like it's so good. Hey buddies! Look at this. He's gonna he's spying on us right now though. Oh my gosh. Recording everything. Yeah, no. There's gonna be a video of like all we the don't people trust that. to this droid. I, I, honestly that would be kind of funny though. But he's stepping on my dress a little bit, but oh my god. Hey, how's it going? Hi. <laughs> Oh, sure. We got a photo request. Oh, we got another one here too. All right, the video is back up. I'm pretty sure I'm recording upside down, but you know, I'll switch that later. That's fine. Stormtroopers! Look at this guy. God, there's a Kylo. Everyone looks so good. I should have did a. <gasps> Love the Kylo look. Thank you. Ah. He's guarding C3PO and R2. With C3PO? We can? Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> We're gonna get a picture here. <laughs> Our Bebo is back. Now we have everyone. I gotta show it again. He's back. Oh, excuse me. It's so good. From Little Shop of Horrors. I found you again. I'm just so obsessed with it. This guy is literally dressed as Shang-Chi and he's like DJing a party. Like, it's a straight up. It's a straight up party here at MegaCon. Let's go. I'm in love with the Sam. So good. Thank you. Everyone looks so good. <laughs> Megan, there's Sims. I don't want to be in this line. We're out of not me either. The line for the beer is long, as it should be. <laughs> also, up ahead, you can see freaking. Huggy Wuggy from Poppy's Playtime. It's absolutely insane. But here, here's a better look at the party. Hey, 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 hey,
feel like about a lot of things. Like even today, being with John and Charlie, being with them. Where's John? Yeah, it's so dry. There's nothing wrong with that. Like there's 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 nothing wrong with these two other actors. <laughs> in my mind, they are just both so good and so pleasant to be around. And you know, we you know our business can be hairy at times. And you know, to have two guys of their their talent and be just genuine human beings, it's fun to it's fun to hang out with. It's not complicated. It's a wonderful thing. So uh, you got to say a whirlwind tour coming in, and he's been busy. Uh, it's going to be here. Here he is. He's here. What is it like for you guys to start to do the fun circuit as friends once you get to know each other? Because this, I think, this is one of those beautiful communities in the world. Like it's an actual community. Comic cons are about sharing in person. We're not digital. We're here together. How is doing those together as friends and traveling? Well, John educated me. Like in those first few years, when I. I first went to my first con in 2015. I'd never, you know, John had been doing it because of the walking there. He was like a veteran of these, of these things. Like he kind of told me how to do it and what, what you to expect and what not to expect. And, you know, like, I learned from him. He's like, uh, he's like one of the, uh, the OGs. So, um, so, uh, so it's fun to be able to do it we with him now. And be, you know, we've both kind of like, you know, been on the circuit for a couple of years. <laughs> Veterans of the Comic Con game. Well, this was an absolute pleasure. Hey, it's been a little bit. Got some beers here at the Dragon's Milk. So probably, probably gonna sit and get some taste. All right, that's a wrap on day one for us. Technically it's day three for Megacom, but day one for us, we well, I will see you tomorrow for Sunday. Shake? And yeah, bubble gum out. Bunny, oh, yeah. where are we? Oh, that's such a good saddle. It is day two of MegaCon, technically day four, but day two for us. Bunny and I are dressed up as Lokis. I am Sylvie. She is Alligator Loki. Hi, you're just the cutest alligator in the world. And we're in line to meet Steve from Blue's Clues. The most exciting celebrity here by far. Yes. You can see the excitement radiating off of Bunny. <laughs> I have to put my crown all the way up because it keeps slipping, but we're here. We're here for Steve. I'm so excited. My year of musical artist's body of work includes Christmas on Mars, The Professionals, and Young Sheldon. Today he joins us to discuss his career as well as the role that made him a friend to an entire generation as the first human host of Blue's Clues for several seasons and his return to the series in front and behind the camera, during which the whole time he never forgot you. Megacon 2013, please welcome Mr. Steve Burns. starting to hurt but Steve was amazing I was tearing up at the Steve Burns panel it, yeah it was so special but now we're in line for another panel <laughs> we're in line for Rosario Dawson aka Ahsoka Tano aka Claire um, in all of the Defender series and yeah I'm excited for this one too this is the same theater that we saw Charlie Cox and Vincent D'Onofrio in yesterday so 
Ahsoka, Ahsoka. All right, we got some Not even close. Not even close. I am so excited. The gifts, the gifts don't help. They're Wonder playing. Woman's like really kicking butt. <laughs> and Batgirl's just like jumping down. They're playing a game right now. All right, and last question number six. Which game would you rather play, Dying Lights or Ratchet and Clank? I don't know either of these games, but let's see what the audience says. Dying Light's kind of like a, uh, a, this is related if, if you know where we're going. Uh, Dying Light or Ratchet and Clank? Uh, win winner, Ratchet and Clank. Give yourself a round of applause for playing, playing everybody. Rosario. 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 Sesame Street character and or Muppet, if you had to pick one. See, you hear how personal that was right there? See, I can't do that to Grover or to Big Bird or to, you know, I mean, there's so many of them, but I feel like because Snuffleupagus is actually a legend, he could be here right now. It was not me, it was not me. I mean, I am no Jedi. Mm. So, 30% of the people in here thought that you might be interested in some sit action. And I'm like, wait, what? Hold on. Wow, y'all. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Dark Soka. Yeah, okay. Yeah. But 70% of y'all, make Soka. some noise. Do this, you will get the Show makeup over here, that's so cool. Also, the Grinch, absolutely amazing. <laughs> Spider Man, I don't know, it, it, it never gets, it never gets old. It, it never gets old. I just, I love seeing Spider Man. <laughs> Maybe one year I will get myself a Spider Man castle. Thank you. <laughs> yes, look. <laughs> oh, speaking of, is the alligator like We're on a mission to find Wally again, which I think is this way. So, let's go see. Ah, da, da, da. It's very crowded. That's okay. That's okay. We found him. He is. He's right here. Oh my gosh. Ah, Wally. Guys, it, he's real. He's so cute. I oh, I just want to love him. I want to love him so hard. Wally. Wally was absolutely everything. I loved him. Absolutely everything. I could imagine. Alrighties. I think we're gonna turn back left. Oh, I'm so sorry. So sorry. Let's get through some people's. Come on, buddy. We got it. We got it. All right. <laughs> they got the cool zoo, which has a real life sloth, which I would love to hold, but I do not want to freak out any sloths or animals with bunny. I'm not concerned about bunny. Just want to be respectful to them. There's a oh, there's all the Star Wars Millennium Falcon car. Look at that. Han and Chewie. Oh look, I can get the front. Han and Chewie. R2 C3PO and the pod. Oh my god. Oh a Batmobile. Oh, I think we can go in and kind of check it out, but let's check it from this area. Oh. 
my goodness. All right, we're gonna circle around. All right, the Millennium Falcon car. Look at all these chewy. Hot. Check out this huge Chewbacca head. Oh my goodness. Like, I'm just waiting for him to talk. Also, had his belt. And my little boy, Phoebe. All right, we he are here where the celebrity autographs are. We got the Cobra Kai people there, Ralph Macho, William Zapka. Really cool. Kind of walking through, just getting a feel for where everyone is. This must, this has to be something big because it is a huge line. Huge line. I, I personally, and oh, and there's Steve. All right. Steve. Here is Steve Burns, AKA Blues Clues. That is so cool. I, yeah, I kind of want to go meet Blues Clues. I'm, I'm not going to lie. We have Lana Perella from Once Upon a Time. We saw her panel yesterday. She was so funny, such a sweetheart. Like, I, I absolutely adore her now. Zachary Levi, which I know a lot of people really love from Shazam. I have not watched Shazam, so I can't speak on that. We have Matthew Lewis, who I met last year, who plays Neville, we all know. I love me. Neville Longbottom. And somebody's here cosplaying as McGonagall. And it's so good. It's so good. I can't see what my phone is pointing to, so I hope I got a clip of that. Oh, my gosh. John Cleese. Let's see. Sam Raimi, which I think is a super cool... Oh, hello. <laughs> I like how Giancarlo Esposito, which I know, oh my gosh, his panel was packed, packed. They had overflow lines for the overflow lines for Esposito, but crazy, but he is loved. I know Cade really wants to get to that panel. Unfortunately, he missed it. Rosario Dawson, who we just saw, oh my gosh, she's so funny. This Conchu is absolutely crazy. All right, party people, we are back in the car. Kate has picked me up, Bon Bon, and I are playing Passenger Princess. And yeah, that's a wrap on MegaCon 2023, my second convention ever. Crazy. I, like, want to get into more comic conventions, like would love to be able to travel to some and do a couple a year not just like the yearly one but megacon was great we did a lot the first day group dressed up as adventure time i was bubblegum princess bunny was bum bum Cade was reluctantly the ice king <laughs> We sat in the panel for Lana Perella, who plays Regina, AKA the Evil Queen from Once Upon a Time. We got to see the Star Wars setup. We sat in the panel with Charlie Cox and Vincent D'Onofrio, AKA Matt Murdock, Daredevil, Kingpin slash Wilson Fisk, the Marvel people know. That was awesome. We explored the convention. We took lots of photos and then I came back with Bunny for Sunday. Obviously, as Sylvie and Alligator Loki, we saw the Steve Burns panel, which was so emotional. We saw the Rosara Dawson panel, which was incredible. I got to see Wally and some other things throughout the convention. I went up and I got a picture with Steve. And then I bought myself a lounge fly. <laughs> That's the recap. That's a lot. You did pretty much everything you wanted to do. Uh, the only didn't, the only thing I missed. We didn't see um, John Bernthal at all. We didn't Same. see John Bernthal. I would have really liked to see John Bernthal, and we did not. I, I did not get to go to the Marvel cosplay meetup, which I would have loved to go to, but I was in line for Steve. So, but that's okay. There'll be 
plenty of more meetups. I personally, this is my favorite cosplay. So, I mean, I will be bringing Sophie to conventions forever. Because I just, I, I don't know. I just, lo I, I, I just love her. I just love her. I also feel really powerful in this. Like, like I can beat somebody up. But oh, once you look at the little details, did I tuck it? Oh, I am also wearing a Loki scepter necklace and these Loki little rings. So I got all the little details. Any last words? Just driving. <laughs> He's just driving. There's the convention center in the background. Bye, MegaCon. Hopefully we'll see you next year for all four days.